Hey, what's up guys? Fried Egg here, and this is going to be a new show that I'm doing thanks to a viewer. Uh, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to call it uh, EQ Next Roundtable Rants, just because I'm probably going to give, uh, give my opinion on, on whatever the roundtables are currently. I'm probably actually going to go do like a backlog and make a whole series out of this, but still very amped about EverQuest Next, and... It's definitely the game I'm most interested in right now, uh, besides the, besides anything that uh, Robot Entertainment might might have coming out in the future. They have hinted that they are there are games coming next year, so I'm excited for those. But anyways, back to EQ next. Uh, I will say this uh, first off. I'm gonna get a shout out out of the way. Uh, someone from Disciples of Vox, which I have their site open right here. Uh, he didn't say exactly who he was, but he's a member of this guild, and he wanted me to shout out their guild. Uh, it's going to be an EverQuest Next guild, and uh, here's some info. And I'm going to have it linked down in the description, but uh, he's the one that, in, he or she, they inspired me to make this video and, and start doing this series. So here's their proper shout out. Go check out their guild and their webpage here, and if you want to you want to join up in EverQuest Next guild before the game launches, well, go ahead and consider Disciples of Vox. And now on to um, the first topic. This is also by the by request of the person from Disciples of Vox. He wanted me to start off with this topic. This one I think is uh, a little older, maybe three weeks old. But the uh, roundtable topic is about guilds. Um, one guild per character in EverQuest next or more. So my, this is pr this was probably one of the the most, one of the most fluff um, roundtables so far, in my opinion. I, I'm, I definitely was. Every MMO I've played ever since EverQuest One, uh, I've always been in a guild. But I, uh, yeah, I don't really, I don't really care too much about some of these specifics here. It's just like to me, guilds were always there. I, I never really looked for more functionality out of the guilds. It was just like, all right, yeah. Play a game, join a guild. That's who you raid with. Uh, you know, here it gives you the four options. Uh, uh, for, for, for one of the least votes was I have no preference. I kind of fell into that. I, I believe I even voted for that. And then another one is I want to join more than one guild at a time. There are social groups, and I want to, I want as many as as I'd like. I prefer to keep it simple. One character can belong to one guild no more. That that one by ten percent. And lastly, I like different types of guilds, e.g. families, alliances, guilds, and you belong to one of each type. Now, see, my, I can't even, I, I can't remember if this was actually a thing in, in WoW or even EverQuest, but I do remember there just being like chat groups. It's been so long since I played WoW, I can't remember, but I remember like having guild chat and then like you could, I remember being part of like just a chat group. Now... To me, like, that's an easy solution for this. It's like, you know, there could be a, a group that you form, just a chat group you form with friends just for chatting purposes. I can see that. But having having a whole separate, you know, multiple guilds just to service the needs of chatting, I think, is almost kind of silly. So that's kind of my opinion on that. I just, I've always felt like one guild was plenty. And... Uh, as far as multiple characters, like, you know, I've done that before where I had, you know, had a, a lobby character that was in a lobby guild that, you know, was kind of different and fun and I would do that. But I I never really thought much about, you know, wanting to be in multiple guilds with one character. I just, all I really cared about was finding that one guild and, you know, sticking with those people. Um, as far as a, a bigger social aspect, I guess, you know, being being a part of more guilds is, is beneficial, but even whatever, I can think of multiple games, MMOs particularly, talking about MMOs, but uh, guilds were, you know, you had, you had guilds that were friendly guilds. And I remember in EverQuest 1, my first guild, we were kind of small and we had to, to do some of the bigger content, the more difficult content, we would have to partner up with a friendly guild. And we would do that you know, quite often. It's like, hey, when we want to do this raid, it takes a little bit more people. So we, we would talk to them and raid with them. And I, I, even in WoW, I think we would, you know, we had 
we had we had guilds where we were kind of friendly where we would maybe not do official raids together but like when it came to doing pickup raids you know we would get with get with uh certain you know usually people from the same guild but the guild thing i don't think that this is uh, this is anything that's going to be game changing or anything like that it's guilds are i think my opinion i think are just they're they're there and there's there's not really too much more to improve on. Like I'm glad that they they that I'm glad they asked. Uh, I I, re I realize that we're gonna have quite a long time of uh, for the development time of uh, EverQuest next. So you know some of these roundtables are gonna be uh, a little watered down in my opinion and on things that aren't really that important. But that's to be expected. I mean, by the time this game launches, I I would expect there's gonna be a few hundred of these roundtables. Uh, discussions and polls so i'm i'm fine with you know understanding there's gonna have to be some some fluff in there and i consider this one of the fluff what fluff fluff, uh, fluff topics <laughs> anyways guys that's pretty much all i have to say on guilds and i will yeah i'm gonna record a few more of these and start uploading them so let me know if you guys like them other than that that's it for this remember to go check out i'll show it again uh click it there it is. Uh, go check out Disciples of Vox. They are <laughs> they are already recruiting. So if you if you're if you're really really amped up and stoked to get a uh, get yourself an EQ next skill, go check out Disciples of Vox. But anyways, guys, this has been Fried Egg, and this has been the first episode of EverQuest Next Roundtable Rants. And uh, hopefully you guys like it because I'm gonna make a bunch of more of these. So yeah, talk to you guys soon.